All right, we're gonna spend some time working on the perfect squat and lunge form. Form is critical when you're doing any exercise, but it's absolutely important when you're working your lower body. Let's start out with a basic squat. I'm gonna show you from the front, and then I'll turn sideways just so you can see it from both angles. That way you can check your form at home. Nice deep squat right here. Arms are totally up to you. You can move them or not. The most important part about a squat is when I'm down at the bottom, my chest is up, I can lift my toes as I'm seated back at the bottom of the movement. How deep you go is really more about your flexibility, but wherever you are at the bottom, don't come forward. Keep it all upright. Let's look at it from the side. Feet are shoulder width. We sink down into it. See how I can lift my toes. I'm not pushed forward on the balls of my feet. Chest is up nice and high. I never lose eye contact if there were a mirror here. Just right there, squeezing at the top of the move, just like this. That is a perfect squat. Let's move on to lunges. Same thing, I'm gonna show you forward, then we'll turn sideways so you can see it from both directions. With a lunge, most people are comfortable resting their hands on their hips. You could also clamp them in front of you, whatever you're comfortable with there. We're gonna step forward, really sinking down into that lunge. Now you're gonna notice my body's not pushed forward. I'm leaned back, shoulders are up, and my knee is never tracking over that toe. Let's look at it from this direction. Step forward, sink down into it, totally upright, not forward, straight line all the way down to that ankle, never pushed forward over that toe. You always need to have strong posture straight up and down. That way when you're lunging, we're keeping that knee exactly where it needs to be. Just like that. That's it.